Hello everyone. So I was just sitting around chilling, doing math. I mean, I actually, I was about to go to bed really, if you want me to be completely honest here. But then I decided, you know, my skin, it feels like it needs a mask. You know, I tend to like to do a face mask like once a week type of thing for my skin. However my skin is feeling, if I feel like I need like a charcoal treatment, if I feel like I need like a tea tree treatment type of thing. Or sometimes I feel like I need a Pepto-Bismol treatment. What? No. Never have I ever said to myself, hmm, I think my skin feels like it would like a dose of some Pepto right about now. I feel like there are stranger things that the internet has suggested before, so I guess I shouldn't have been too surprised when y'all wanted me to try out the Pepto-Bismol face mask. If you don't know, Pepto-Bismol, it's that like very famous pink liquid that's supposed to help with people who have digestive problems, if you've got like an upset stomach or something. I've personally never tried Pepto-Bismol before, but I've heard it tastes really not pleasant, but like pleasant enough where if you have stomach problems, you'll drink it. I don't know. It's supposed to reduce redness, inflammation, tighten your pores. So, um, cool. I mean, I guess I'm all for that. So I guess I should show you guys my face. At the moment, my skin isn't doing too, too bad. I've got a couple things that are starting to pop up among my brows, but otherwise, I mean, I think my skin looks pretty dang good for my skin. It'll be good to have a comparison, right? So there's my skin. Before the mask, let's cherish it in case the mask does something horrible. I guess step one of this hack or hoax is to put your hair up. I mean, I don't think that's actually a part of this. I don't think there's like a step-by-step -step method or anything, but I just want to get my hair out of my face with my Hello Kitty hair thing. Yes. Got this at Ulta not too long ago. And, uh... I mean, it's just ridiculous, right? <laughs> oh well. So I guess to start off, I'm gonna shake this up. I don't know if you're supposed to shake Pepto, but I feel like I shake most things, so why not? <laughs> I don't like it. It's like a weird pepperminty chalk. Mm-mm. I don't like it. I'm gonna dump this. Oh, it's like, it's a little chunky. Dang. I would have a hard time stomaching that, but like I said, if I had stomach troubles, I guess I'd probably do anything. So I'm just gonna take this stupid little foundation brush that I got in a kit at Forever 21. I just got it because it had cats on the handle and I thought it was cute. It comes in handy for times like this. So I guess you just like... Ooh, it's really cold! Oh, like super cold? Ooh. Does it feel like that when it's gone down too? Like down your throat? Ooh. Ooh. Okay. God, I look cute. Like way more cute than usual, right? I think so. Must be this Hello Kitty hairband and Pepto Bisball face mixture. Is that enough, you guys? I feel like that should be enough. I feel like you're supposed to use a semi-thin layer. Yeah. I mean, it goes on very smooth. I feel so weird reviewing Pepto-Bismol on my face. But hey, that's what I'm here for. Okay, so it kind of just looks like I got a bad sunburn, but I think you're just supposed to like let this dry. I don't know how long it's gonna take or anything, so I'm just gonna go and sit down on the couch, watch some YouTube or something, and then I'll be back whenever this is all dry, so I will see you all in just a second. Ready? Ding! And we're back. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is like completely dry and everything. I didn't do anything fun like watching YouTube videos. I just did the dishes, so it's been like 10-ish minutes, 10-15 minutes, and then I went to take a sip of water and I was like, my mustache area feels a bit crusty, so um, I'm gonna assume that means I've got some fuzzies mixed into my Pepto-Bismol, huh? Yep, there it is. Can you see the crackliness? Super cute, huh? <laughs> I just, oh. It's really weird because this is so like 
thin and usually when I have a mask on that's like a drying mask like this it feels like the mask is dry or whatever but since this is so like thin and everything it just feels like my skin is this dry and it feels like my skin is crackling off and that's just terrifying thankfully it's just the Pepto so I'm gonna go ahead and use some Bioderma I'm just trying to think of creative ways that I can use this up um ooh, good job Bioderma Looks like you were meant for Pepto, weren't ya? Yeah. <laughs> so pink. Alright, so I think I got all of it. That just took a couple of cotton pads and some Bioderma. My face is still a bit wet from the Bioderma, but what do you guys think? Does it look like it worked? Do my pores look tighter? and more awesome. Does my skin look any less red and inflamed? Maybe. Maybe. I mean, it certainly feels good. I don't know, you guys. I mean, it feels like I just used a face mask. Like, my skin feels pretty smooth. It doesn't feel quite as smooth as if I used something like my Origins charcoal mask, but like it still feels very smooth. I guess I'm gonna need to see the playback to see if my pores look any nicer, to see if this is really a hack or hoax, and then I will also need to wait until tomorrow morning to see if I have pimples all over my face, because I have very sensitive acne prone skin. So I will let you know by putting that on the bottom of the video here if it broke me out or not. Hack? Hoax? I don't know. You tell me. What do you think? Do you think this worked, you guys? As of right now, I don't see anything wrong with it, especially if you've got some Pepto laying around your house. I feel like a lot of people typically do. You know, I feel like it's one of those things that a lot of people just have around their house. You know, they've got some aspirin, they've got some tampons, they've got some Pepto-Bismol. I don't know, maybe? You guys will have to let me know. Do you think this is a hack? Do you think that it's a hoax? Do you use this mask? Do you use other masks that are actually, like, marketed as masks? You should let me know. Also, as always, if you have any weird internet-type beauty hacks or whatever that you want me to test out here on my channel, please do go ahead and leave a comment down below so that I can put that on my list of things to try and then hopefully test it out for you guys someday. But yeah, as always, I just hope the video was helpful and or enjoyable for you. If it was, please do go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. I'd really appreciate it. And if you're new here, hey, hi, hello, how are you? You can go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more content from me in the future. I would love to have you here. And as always, I just hope you guys are all doing well. And until next time, just stay well until then. Bye! I just realized I did this whole outro in my Hello Kitty bow headband thing. Did I rock it? <laughs> I don't know, guys. I'm kind of feeling this. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I went to a club, right? And um, they had no baggy pants and no sneakers. That was wild. I, could, I didn't know what to think about that.